Right now, one of the differences between Secretary Clinton and myself is how we raise money for our campaigns. Secretary Clinton has several super PACs. She has raised, just in the last reporting period alone, $15 million from Wall Street. Not to mention giving speeches behind closed doors to Wall Street firms for hundreds of thousands of dollars. Now, what I kind of think is, if somebody is going to be paid $225,000 a speech, it's probably a great, wonderful speech that she would want to share with the American people. I am very proud to tell you we do not have a super PAC. We don't want the money from Wall Street or corporate America. What we have done in this campaign in terms of fundraising is literally revolutionary. We have received, and this is really unbelievable, something I never in a million years would have thought could have happened. We have received, up to this point in the campaign, four million individual contributions. That is more contributions than any candidate in the history of this country at this point in a campaign. So to paraphrase Abraham Lincoln at Gettysburg, this campaign, which by the way, do you know what the average campaign contribution is? $27. So I am not indebted to Wall Street, the drug companies, the fossil fuel industry. I'm indebted to millions of people for that 27 bucks. So to paraphrase Abraham Lincoln at Gettysburg, this campaign truly is a campaign of the people, by the people, and for the people. <laughs>